Barnsdale on our way to Lang Lang. And I've gone to get fuel. Um, I've gone to get fuel and pulled in waiting. Next minute this van pulls up next to me. Car and van, it's probably the same length as our van. Um, an older couple. And he fills up, does whatever. He also washes his car with the squeegee too. I forgot to tell you that. Oh really? Yeah. He decided to wash his car. The whole of his car basically with the squeegee. Yeah. And it was so busy, like there was cars lining up behind us. Um, so then he goes to pay, pulls out as he's swinging the back left side of his van clips the bowser cup he's hooked it onto his van and it's pulled the bowser's like pose and then it's flung off the ladies come out and gone stop and everything went down he ended up saying that he didn't do anything wrong i know he said that he didn't do anything wrong and that he didn't have to fill out any paperwork or give his details or anything Anyway, he was literally going to drive away. He was like, no, you yep. need to come and do, fill out your details and whatnot. But anyway, it's done. That was hectic. Yeah, I was waiting in the caravan and I'm like, where the hell is she? It was like two minutes up the road. It's on the back of the caravan. Yeah, mate. We yeah. got skateboards, we got bikes, we got scooters, we got the whole lot. Yeah, so that was like a 15 minute fuel fill up turned into like a 45 minute fuel fill up. Welcome to Lang Lang. It's been raining. Lots and lots of rain as you can see. Caravan's all packed up. Puddles. Oh, we're here. Cars. They're in the in the caravan. Three kids in the caravan, locked up. But water's alright. We're alright. Car's alright, caravan's alright. We'll be right. We've got the car hooked up at the moment. But I've just realised my U beard idea. So my U beard idea was we got a 100 amp lithium battery in the car and I don't really use it unless I'm running the fridge. So I was gonna use it to discharge into the caravan and use the DC to DC in the caravan to basically draw off it like an alternator. But it kept cutting out and I didn't know why. So I looked it up in the in the specs of the paperwork of the DC to DC and basically it needs to be over 12.8 volts to know that it's all right and keep um, pulling juice off it, which is basically nominal voltage for a lithium battery. So kind of cooped that one. But it sort of just trickles, so the charge gets charged up till about 13.2 on the car and then basically charges until 12.8 <laughs> and then it cuts out again. So it's intermittent but, you know, it keeps you alive, keeps, you, keeps the fridge going and let the kids watch TV and stuff like that. But what we're going to do is we're probably going to pick up a 2000 watt inverter so we can just um, chuck it in the car. We we're planning on doing that anyway. Because we've got a few trips oh, next year kind of thing. Um, we're thinking about going to the Cape. So we're going to do Cape with just the car. So a 2000 watt inverter would be nice. Um, then you can use induction if you wanted to. Just opens up a whole heap of things for you. So we'll grab one of them and then I'll be able to literally plug in a 15 amp lead from the caravan to the car. And it will just run through the AC charger and it won't cut out or nothing like that. So basically if you drive the car every day, um, charge that battery back up to 100 
then discharge it back into the caravan batteries. It doesn't give you heaps, but you know, on these long days that are rainy and everything, it just keeps you alive instead of having to go, oh shit, I need power or something like that. So, just another little trick for you. Alright, well, we're going to enjoy some rainy inside trying to control the kids' weather. We're listening to what are we listening to at the moment? Lego songs. Lego songs. Everyone's going a bit mental in the car around. Right? So, this is Mush's favourite movie at the moment, Lego 2. So we'll see how we go with that. at the forest caves yep can only go on low tide with this one yeah we're sort of three hours from high so we'll see, we'll see. We'll see how we go <laughs> not really sure on what the walk's like but we're here we we'll might as well have a look what we'll do with the kids Definitely. come on kitties let's go, let's go. Kitties. <laughs> yeah sand sand let's go Hey Mosh. What are we looking for? Forest Should we go see if we can find them? Yeah. Let's do it. Yeah, I reckon it's where them people are down there. Yeah. Pretty we'll cool walk here. Al walk along the beach. Steph's just directing me to go higher. Oh, it looks so small. <laughs>
back on the beach again. What was last time we were on the beach? Oh, I guess Lang Lang's got a beach. <laughs> Kinda. On a lake. Take a long time. Oh, I've had a spill. Good. No. Good, Geneve. This is for you, Geneve. Jay blends hair. I never went there to get a haircut, I'm sorry. But I will come back. I I'm promise. Video. I'll, I'll give you a shout out. Seth says no, but it. we'll do it, mate. We'll put it in there. Miami. Check it out. What? Can you go on top of the rock? Oh, oh, how Stand on the rock. We've been surrounded. Oh. We're alright. Whoops. I want to go to mummy. That's alright, we'll wait for the water to go out. Ready. Oh. <laughs> Whoa, how was that? For me. Is that cool? For me too. What's for lunch, good looking? Well, I made myself. Oh, not me. No, because you said I murdered it, so here's your <laughs> ham and chicken sandwich. Oh, can I have some for Legit? Yeah. Did you show them the, did you show them the view? No, not yet. How's this spot for lunch? <laughs> Pinch me. So nice. No drones allowed here though? No drones. Oh well, it's a bit windy anyway. Uh, we are on Phillip Island. We're just down from. Sorry, I'll put you on camera. We're just down from the par uh, Penguins Paradise or Paradox. Oh, I don't know. Penguins Parade. That's what it's called. They um the penguins come in at night time. And people pay money to come see them. Looks pretty sick, but they only come in at like eight thirty, nine o'clock, and it's like yeah, that's probably a bit too late for us. But that's where it is. Big grandstands and stuff. But wow, this place is unreal. There's a dude surfing down the bottom there. Probably can't see it. Ripper spot for bloody lunch. This is living Susan. Nah, Barry. Here's your sanger with your requested. Thanks. I'm a serial killer too now. What do you think of the lunch spot? So nice. String killer. Come check this out. I have to put my jumper on because it's a bit chilly. Nah, I don't know what you're on about, mate. <coughs> da -na -na -na. <laughs> Stop it. <coughs> mate, I could get used to doing this all the time. Be unreal banana peel. So good. Yeah, look at that. Car set up. Boys are loving it. Wicked beach. Wish I could put the drone up, it looks sick. But that's alright. Some places you can, some places you can't.
If anyone's traveling around and an almond and iron about Phillip Island, it's pretty sick. Yeah. I reckon like the whole bottom end or the eastern western side of it is just the nature reserve there. There's nice little drives around the coast and like we just pulled up at the the part at the end where you can go do the boardwalk for 500 meters and like even this car park. Like look where we've parked. <laughs> like look where we've parked. It's just incredible. And there's a the little island there. I think I think that's the island. Okay, I'm gonna throw a bit of knowledge here. Seal Rock. I think it's got the largest yeah. sea lion colony yeah, in Australia yeah. on this island. Yeah. Quote yeah. me if I'm wrong, but I'll tell you when I get back because there's probably a sign down there, and I'll correct myself if I'm wrong. But let's go check it out. And also, weirdly, they have Ben and Jerry's right here. Why is that weird? It's I a tourist know. thing. I know, but like, what a weird spot to have Ben and Jerry's, don't you think? I just think that's weird, but anyway. <laughs> it's ice cream. And everyone gets it. And it's them. hot. Maybe not in winter. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Alright, let's go check it and out. And... Oh, right. Sorry. Um, you can't really put your drone up anywhere here, too. Nah, because it's a nature reserve. Yeah, so... When you're driving along the little... The, there's like a coast loop road back, and it's on the, on the dirt, and you're probably like, I don't know, 10 metres from the cliff edge. And it's just picturesque and yeah. It looks the, so nice with the drone. Yeah, it sucks because we don't have a good camera. No. So all of our stuff it's is filmed on an GoPro, iPhone. GoPro or an iPhone. So apparently starting out. Support us now so yeah. we can get a better camera. <laughs> <laughs> but it doesn't do it justice, but it's so Daddy nice. Wants the, the yeah, hang on. Mia wants to tell you something. What's up, Mosh? We can have an ice cream. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see if you play your cards right. Yeah. See how you go on this boardwalk. Yeah. This spot is so nice. Me and Tay. Super nice. Uh, yeah. Boardwalk's nice for the kids, they can't get off. Freaking, there's like this, what are they called? Succulents all over the ground with flowers. Yeah, but it's just so green. And the Everything. colours are just awesome. Yeah. It's, it's not even my sunny's no. thing. <laughs> and like the water just here is just. Look at that little pool there. That looks hey, awesome. Look. And apparently there's a blowhole around here too. Yeah. Yeah. Philip Bolland's turning it on for us. Sure is. I think we'd pick the day for it, that's for sure. Just incredible. we end up getting ice cream <laughs> after a long hard walk oh my god is the goose coming to get it yeah. you better eat it up how is it kelly so dad this is the main way to come in and then you can go an alternative route yeah well, look at that down there. Check this out. We need a better camera. <laughs> oh, well. We need a better camera. Yes. That just looks so sick. Like the colours in it. I know. It's not even sunnies that are making it look like that either. No. But just like, I don't know. Like, look at my rocks down there. It's like. Jake was saying that he feels like South Australia is going to be a lot like this. Well, I don't know. But more accessible to the beaches, I think. Oh, yeah. Well, I think there's a lot of beaches like this. Yeah. In South Australia. There's a lot of cliffs and stuff. So, but yeah. It's so beautiful. So nice. As our kids watch their iPads. 
we'll enjoy the view, hey?